Boom. In the truck. Maybe I should open the door there. Some air. Too much sunlight. Who cares? Oh. Before I do all that stuff. Ah. Drink some water. <laughs> mm. I should open the window. How I could be that long? Hey, look. I just came from the uh, office, Max. Of course, uh, I have this project, you know. I don't know if you know about this project. 12 million. 12 million black voices. Uh, the text is by Richard Wright. I turned it into a, a script. Well, this is two of them in one. Uh, it's a long process. But anyway, this is the old binder that my sister had it for me with the sleeves. So I went to Office Max and I got new binders. I have two copies in there. So I'm going to put a copy in each. And then I have this whole other sheet that I have to do for administrative purposes. For the, it's a project, don't worry. If you're at the ADOS conference, you'll find out about it somehow. I'll write stuff up. I don't know how I'll advertise I'll do something like that. So that's happening. Uh, so that's good. So I'm already, I'm wearing my one of my ADOS shirts. You know, this is the long sleeve one. It's sort of hot out today. Why I got the long sleeve one on? I don't know. Anyway, but I'm not going to bring my, I'm only going to bring my uh, Ados uh, sweatshirt, the hoodie that I got, because I got something on the bed. I'm going to bring that, uh, but I'm not going to buy any more paraphernalia. I'll wait till I get there. I'll buy the paraphernalia, but I have one, a shirt on order. We'll see if that shows up. But you know, when you travel, there's only two days, but well, I'm going to be going for five days. But people don't realize, actually, I'll be in a car, so it doesn't matter anymore because I can bring whatever I want. But usually you travel very light. I travel lighter than light, 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 light. You find when you travel, especially you go someplace, you find you only wear one or two pairs of pants. I mean, I use my I use my, my black um, uh, Lee's, um, uh, you know, American main jeans, black, you know, and usually some uh, some some other kind of, you know, African fabric or something like, like I got on now, right? And uh, maybe one other pair of pants, two pairs of shoes, and a lot of underwear, a lot of shirts, whatever it is. That's what it is. What am I looking at here for? Oh, but here's what happened. Oh, I went to Office Max because I was supposed to go. Let me tell you what's happening. They have uh, early in-person voting. Early in-person voting in Virginia, you know. And uh, I'm going to read this. Yeah. Mondays through Friday, September 17th to October 30th. Every Monday through Friday for for these weeks from, uh, I guess, you know, about a month, ahead, whatever, it's, we're in October right now. And at first I was going to vote today because I think in November I'll be in New York. I'll be leaving for South Africa. Uh, but then I said, oh, no, but I'll be back from the conference, you know, and i still be able to vote. So what I'm going to do, right, because I already know it's for the governorship, you know, and the governor, oh, the Democrats handed this out. Um, so they get the the the... the the uh, Hillary Clinton guy is uh, is up there. A bunch of other, they have all the Democrats that they give you a thing. But I looked at the thing. Now, you have to understand. Let me explain this to you real quick. Voting. <laughs> they call it voting. But as it as it's happened now, because of whatever have you, it's not really voting that you're doing. You're doing polling. You get me? You're, you're, in other words, voting... Voting as is constituted in the United States is the most accurate poll. You know, they have all these other polls, Q polls, whatever, the polls that they have. Well, that's that's what they have. You know what I mean? And 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 then they use that to say, oh, there's so many people this, so many people that. Well, the accurate thing is how people actually voted. And that's the polling. Polling, right? Now, if you want to be involved in politics or really voting, then you have to get the candidate that you want, which means you have to start with. Now, they, now everybody's at the school boards now. They really... Raising heck at school boards all over the country. Let's see what happens with that. But so I don't look when I vote. I don't look at it as voting. I look as polling. If I really wanted to vote, then I have to research all the you know, the candidates, whatever have you. So for me, the 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 Hillary Clinton guy, this Terry Hillary Clinton guy, and then this other guy. You know, they're all into law and order, whatever have you. This other guy, the the, the Republican guy. He's I don't know some some stuff that he do. He's a hedge fund he's a he's a minor, a, a, a banking kind of guy so you get the politicians and the bankers all together okay well i'm not voting for either one of them because on a cat on the on the on the uh, ballot for virginia governorship they also have this sister princess um uh, ben what's it 
Yeah, Princess Princess uh, Blanding, B L A N D I N G. Princess Blanding is her name, right? And she got into politics a few years ago because uh, they killed her brother or somebody in her family, you know. And she said, "Whoa!" So she part of this part, part, party. I think it's called a Revolutionary Party. So I'm going like, "Hey, it's a poll. Let me poll for the Revolutionary Party. Why not?" You know, I don't want these other two cats. I don't care about these other cats. You know, but you're wasting your vote. No, that's what I'm saying. You don't waste a vote. <laughs> don't you understand? It's polling. You can't waste an opinion. Opinion poll. It's a official opinion poll. There's no wasting an opinion poll, okay? You say, yeah, but the other guy might get... But you don't understand. Didn't you... Didn't you didn't you all find out that didn't Princeton or one of those Ivy League colleges do some sort of poll and they said that, hey, no matter how you voted... The politicians don't listen to you. They listen to the lobbyists and a bunch of and their friends, basically. So you'll vote. You're wasting your vote when you vote. <laughs> I mean, you're not wasting your vote if you're polling. But if you think you're voting for something that's going to change something, oh, you're sadly mistaken. Then you really got to get into politics. That means you got to go into the local things and, that, and go, you know, to the local clubs and whatever. Hey, good luck trying to visit a Democratic club and see if they, they invite you in, if they... You, become that inner circle yeah I, <laughs> I don't know so anyway so uh so so that's what i made my so what i'm gonna do actually while i'm while since i, I will be in at, at eight or so there's be a lot of political people around say hey who's from virginia here's my idea what else should i do and look at the rest of the ballot who should we vote for because i have to look at the rest of the ballot because you know they got whatever they got here lieutenant governor i guess you know uh i guess that there wouldn't be anything uh uh member house delegates 21st district member house delegates uh commonwealth attorney commonwealth attorney commissioner of revenue that sounds good i mean it sounds something like and a treasurer well, how do you have a commissioner of revenue and a treasurer who must be hers oh, whatever so those are the things we vote on because you know what the, what they do in virginia the, the the big time you know when you have the the major whatever every two years they had the, but then off years they you vote for everything else like the sheriff and all the rest of that stuff like that so i we'll have to look into that and see what's who's playing what okay that's it just wanted to let you know a little little message from me t from the patterson's taking the train to tibet letting you know what i only suspect sitting in this hot uh, ram truck man you all people in the south of Georgia. hey hey some air. Damn it. Let me go in and do something else. Get you something to eat. Later.